for 2010, we're going to take the biggest leap since the original iPhone. And so today, today, we're introducing iPhone 4, the fourth generation iPhone. Now, this is really hot. And there are, there are well over 100 new features, and we don't have time to cover all of them today. So I get to cover eight of them with you. Eight new features of the iPhone 4. The first one, an all new design. Now, stop me if you've already seen this. <laughs> Believe me, you ain't seen it. <laughs> you've got to see this thing in person. It is one of the most beautiful designs you've ever seen. This is, beyond a doubt, the most precise thing, one of the most beautiful things we've ever made. Glass on the front and the rear, and stainless steel running around, and the precision of which this is made is is beyond any consumer product we've ever seen. Its closest kin is like a beautiful old Leica camera. It's unheard of in consumer products today. Just gorgeous. And it's really thin. This is the new iPhone 4. It is just 9.3 millimeters thick. That is 24% thinner than the iPhone GS. Again, a quarter thinner in something you didn't think could get any thinner. As a matter of fact, it is the thinnest smartphone on the planet. So let me point out, let me point out a few of the things, uh, a few of the external things on it. Here are the volume controls, volume up, volume down, and mute. On the front, we have a front-facing camera. We have the receiver. We have the home button. People have asked, what's this? <laughs> Some have even said, this doesn't seem like Apple. What are these lines in this beautiful stainless steel band? Well, it turns out there's not just one of them, there's three of them. And they are part of the entire structure of this phone. That stainless steel band that runs around is the primary structural element of the phone. And there are these three slits in it. It turns out this is part of some brilliant engineering which actually uses the stainless steel band as part of the antenna system. And so one piece is Bluetooth, Wi-Fi, and GPS, and the other is UMTS and GSM. So it's got these integrated antennas right in the structure of the phone. It's never been done before. Three and a half inches, the same size as the iPhone 3GS, Yet with 960 by 640 pixels, that's four times more pixels than the iPhone, G iPhone 3GS. 326 pixels per inch, an 800 to 1 contrast ratio, which is again four times better than the 3GS. We're using IPS technology. This is a very advanced LCD technology which is quite a bit, in our opinion, quite a bit better than the OLED technology for these types of products. And uh, provides much more accurate color and much higher resolution. You can't make an OLED display with this type of resolution right now. And so we think the IPS technology is, is really quite superior. And it results in incredibly sharp text, images, and video.